there's there's the emotional content, right? So I, I try to be as reverent to the original as possible. What the what the song was about for the for the writer or writers, uh, and what it means to them, and the stories that came out of how they wrote it. And I tried to get all of that together for myself, and then what it means to me emotionally. And then at that point, then then the the writer part of me starts thinking about the individual players for sure that I know are gonna are gonna play these things. But then what I'll do is, you know, my writing process is I usually uh, write everything down in words on text per section. Like I want, you know, a big sax solely here, and I, I want uh, clouds of trombones here, and descriptive terms that mean something to me and nobody else. Uh, and in an ideal world, I have time to do this all. And, and I actually have a, an F by 11 piece of paper and I, I put it across the room, like in a circle, like a storyboard. And so I can foreshadow and pick up events and uh, I know where I'm going at all times. Then it just becomes, it's not a beginning or an end, it's just a circle, it's a plot line. Uh, so that's how I usually do it. But what I, what I ended up doing mostly this time, because uh, of my lifestyle, is what I do is I sing the whole thing. Once it's been formulating in my head for a while, I sing the whole thing in my phone uh, from start to finish in the most organic, pure, genuine, honest way that I can. Uh, and then I transcribe the whole flow of that, and then I edit along the way. Then I start orchestrating it. and and changing little things where, okay, that didn't really work like that, or I didn't quite sing it the way that I knew that I wanted to sing it, uh, but it flows like that. So I try and get, get the arrangement to feel more like an improvisation. Once I get it into finale, it's, it's pretty much formed uh, how, I want it, how I want it to sound. Uh, there's not a whole lot of manipulation at that point. Then it's just little edits and, uh, you know, I, I still haven't finished anything. I, was t I remember talking <laughs> to Russell Ferrante, uh, and, and Russ was asking me, so when do you know a chart's finished? And I said, Russ, I've I haven't finished a chart yet. Mm -hmm.